Welcome to Tush Twins, brought to you on MalcolmPresents.com, a streaming network where you hear things you wouldn't hear on any other streaming network. And this is one of our shows, and this show is a streaming, a screaming streaming. It's, it's a screaming streaming. Right. We're screaming and, and we're streaming. And we have and we have personalities that are not allowed on network TV. <laughs> Why not? Uh, why not but I anyway, be on network that, tv uh we should do a whole show on that there's no more network cable. There's, there's no more network there's no more anything it's all there's no more it's all That's a crock a, it's all a crock i tell you i mean there's there no more network there, 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 there are no more landlines but for landlines i i have well it's not even a landline it's it's a digital landline i guess because I, I don't even know how it's I, I, don't don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. Ricky, don't lose that number. It's the only one you have. Anyway, All next, right. start our so, show. Introduce here we us. are. So move over, Jane and Lily. Grace and Frankie. I like that the best right now. Because Lucy mm-hmm. and Ethel, ah, we know about that. Uh, Tina and Amy, we 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 got them. Uh, Betty and Wilma and- will, never, will never go out because they're animated. They'll live forever, right? And so, then there's the Tush the, Twins. Then there's the, the Tush, Tush twins, twins, which will live forever. The Tush Twins, TT, TT, will live forever because we uh we know we stuff. We are family. We, we're family. We've been we, through stuff. We know no, stuff. No, nobody else. Nobody else wants you. That's I, right. Nobody else cares. We don't care. We don't care, it, 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 we don't care if they care. We don't really care. It, we don't give a he- flying freaking hoop. How's that? They don't want to take you either in heaven or hell. They you gotta stay down here. I gotta stay here. I gotta stay in middle middle earth. And suffer. That's right. I gotta stay in middle earth and suffer. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey, we hey, we don't like we we try to avoid suffering on uh, I mean, you know, hey, we fasted this week. Um, I fasted. which is okay. But and, but the and, re- and by the way, and, and I'm fasting today. Right. We don't need we don't want to go, we don't want to go into yeah. that, but He's having a test done, so he's got to clear. Oh, okay. He's got to clear himself out. Yeah, just, you know? just, just uh, uh, yeah, yeah. So, so uh, I, 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 I might do that. that. I, I might do that on a regular basis. Fast for two days a week. Nah, it's not healthy. Yeah, it's not healthy. Actor is not fun. One day might. Two days a week is not a good idea. That's dangerous. Do not do that. I think it's better if you go to have a special dinner. <laughs> So, well, so speaking about you know, special dinners. Yeah. So, so at this point, I'm just going to put up a, a, a little, um, you know, so we don't get ourselves into trouble. I'm going to re- I'm going to read this now. We are not recommending the use of cannabis, but merely giving info on the subject. Consult a physician regarding usage for medical purposes. Thank you for your support. <laughs> okay. That leads into the redhead who is going to talk. Well, about- it's also in New York and New Jersey and Boston and Massachusetts and a lot of places, Oregon, California. It's recreational legal mm-hmm. in the state. Right. It is. But, you can, and you, can you should go, go to-, to a special person who knows what they're doing. A pharmacy that mm-hmm. it starts with an F. Pharmacy. Not- Yes, pharmacy. Because it comes from the farm. Yes, and, it does. And now, and now there's a whole there's been a lot of uh, news about the farmers who farm it, and because the holdup in certain things in different states, especially New York, they're, and they're New Jersey, it more difficult for it mm-hmm. to be sold, for it to be marketed. For you I mean, for instance, you can't still. Um, it's cash. You can't get a bank you account. Can you can use can't. a bank. You can use, okay. you have to use cash. You can't deposit in a bank. You have to, certain banks you can, but there has to be a private bank. It can't be a national bank. It has to be a local net private bank. Right. Right. Because so, it's uh, still Ill- illegal federally. Right. Yes. Right. It's no, just, no. Uh, Which probably won't be that much longer for us nationally, federally. That'll be well, legal. Hopefully. Well, Mitch, are you listening? Mitch. Oh, Mitch. I'm seeing. Are you seeing me blurry? Because I'm seeing Yes, you. I yeah, am. I'm seeing you blurry. I don't Very know blurry. I, don't I think know. it's a camera a little dirty. I, I, you think? 
I don't. Uh, oh, upside down. Uh, uh, oh, maybe you're right. And, and, and there might be a glare in your in your uh, it's a window. Glare. Let me get the. I'm getting it's a glare. You two, you two talk a minute. We'll talk. Well, well, let me tell you what I did this weekend. Now wait, wait till wait till uh, Max gets back. Okay, so, get and, back. And but I'm just giving talk you a little something else. preview. Talk amongst yourself. But, but, talk amongst yourself. Where are you but, going, Max? Vus. Yeah. You can see if she can clean up the glare in the background. Oh, oh okay. And, and I'm wearing my said, special shirt today. Ah, uh, plant-based diet. Yes, it is. And truthfully, it's really good. But yeah, yeah, yeah I, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure uh, what the regulation now, but they, uh, they're they trying to open uh, cafes, cannabis cafes in Los yeah. Angeles, in California. Well, they That's should. Sorry, man. They should. What they did was in New York, you have to have a special license to. <laughs> now it's work. Now, now, you, now you're in the dark. That's you're in the dark. Max, after two after after two years, that's of doing better. It, after two well, years of doing this, I think you should get different equipment. Or move to another uh, room. Or, or move, move to another to, state. Or move to another country. Okay, it's a but anyway. Bit, um, I have to do that. I, think. I don't know. I don't know. That's why. better. It's a little better, yeah. It's a little better. Let me move. I'm getting dizzy. Well, you, you've been dizzy <laughs> since I know you. Motion sickness. You, you're dizzy all the time. All right. What are you guys I'm up to? I'm so dizzy. My what, 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 do you, what, do you, what do you think of, of uh, cafe, uh, cannabis cafes that are open to the public? I think it's wonderful. I think I'm it's a, a great idea. Weary. I'm a little weary about that. It depends who's doing it. If you have a license, you know what you're doing and not overdosing. I think it's a great idea. Yeah, but I and know when we're I went, dosing, but I'm, I'm wondering whether the patrons know how much to take, even if it's low doses. They have to tell you. We, I, talking about that, I went to a pop up uh, dinner, and you have to be invited to this place. And I'm very proud to say I met Miguel Trinidad. He's from Bon Appetit, one of my favorite shows, cooking bon shows. Appetit. Bon Appetit. And he and his staff are the most amazing chefs. We went through, we had a six or seven course meal and everything was explained and how it was infused in the food and how it, how much dosage. So you're not walking out of there totally stoned. You're not going out of there going, oh my God, I am so gone. And first of all, when you eat edibles or cannabis, the pro, the, what you it takes at least an hour to two hours to get into your system. Hmm. It does. So by the time I was home, I was very happy. I was halfway home. I was very happy. Well, you know, it, it's it, there's it's a thing. There's a show called it's Bong Appetit. Who is yes. this guy? The other guy, uh, Abdullah Saeed. Uh, he is the host. He's the host. Is he a He's chef or just the host? Just the host. He goes around. He's an expert okay. on the um, edibles, on the marijuana strains. Like mm -hmm. one episode I watched, which was amazing, and that just cracked me up. It was called Shabbat dinner. Shabbat dinner. He was Shabbat dinner. <laughs> they went to this home, an Orthodox family, and they said, "We'll try it." Well, guess what? They did. And they had such a great, they didn't smoke anything. They just had the edibles. I've learned how to make the best matzo ball soup from this episode. They have a strain called kosher kush. Kosher kush. Yes. I'm learning all, all about all the strains and everything. Kosher kush. And I'm becoming, I'm hopefully, I'm not an expert yet, but Oh, I'm taking God. classes. I'm learning by reading and everything. But I got invited to a pop-up kitchen. It How? was on Sunday morning. How did you get invited? This is my first question. I'll tell you. I was watching Sunday morning on CBS. Oh, mainstream. And Jane Pauley Jane was Pauley. interviewing uh, Miguel Trinidad. And he, they're talking about this pop-up kitchen and people that went there and some people have never had marijuana before and 
they were so amazed how great the food was and how they didn't feel sick or stoned or anything. This, so this, they got home. This, this is restricted to marijuana, right? No other drugs. Just marijuana, not CBD, just cannabis. Now each strain, now he's an expert on this stuff and you have to email him. It's called, it's the company is called 99th Floor. Miguel, hello. Okay, 99th Floor. And you have to tell him about yourself and if he thinks you understand what's going on and you're in the business, you get an invitation. I got an invitation within 10 minutes. Wow. And only 50 people at the time could go. So we went down to, unfortunately, we the whole way Dennis is going, this is ridiculous. I'm never going to do this. This is, I'm never coming to the city again. We came through the Lincoln Tunnel. It the Holland Tunnel was totally closed down going into the city. It was raining and he didn't realize it's the San Gennaro Festival. So it took us over two hours to get into the city. Thank God we left early enough. We got there 10 minutes before it started. And oh, it's on, this place was 132 Mulberry Street. It's not there anymore because each time, once a month, it changes. And But 132 now, Mulberry Street is still there. Yes, it is. But the okay. restaurant, it's a... Um, I'm sorry, we're glad we're giving the... What is it? It's a pop-up restaurant. It's in a beautiful space, modern industrial kitchen, and tables, three tables. And we met this other couple sitting there before we went in, and he's a concierge doctor. And oh, he boy. specializes in marijuana. He gives prescriptions for marijuana and pain and all that. And his wife is his secretary. Oh God! What is it's that? great. So we are there... a doctor who uh, can prescribe pot. But here's the thing: we all we all toasted the new year, and we <laughs> decided you... we're going to do this once a month. Once a month? We're... Yeah, we're going to do this once a month if we can. We're going to because I'm going to get. Is it in New York once a month? It's mm -hmm. it's in any of the five boroughs. We have no idea till the you, day. You want to do once a month at the restaurant? You want to do once a month with that couple? That no, once a month at this pop up restaurant, and we have no idea where it was till that day before. Day before, sound like we the, have the, no the, idea. Sound like the old days of the raves, except do, they, do were... they yes. actually have one in Staten Island. They have one in Staten Island. They the last one was in Brooklyn. Um, they're going to try to keep it in Manhattan because good, it's a little idea. easier for people to come in. Uh, well, let me so know we if got in there, the, and the this. first thing we did, they offered Excuse us. Me, let me know if they Hold get on. into the San Fernando Valley. Mm, I will. Yeah, maybe they have something in Kelo in in the. Uh, I'll Land. ask him because he Land. does. They Malcolm. have it in a few places. Well, I don't. I again, I can. I can uh... What is that? That's our first course. Was a drink. It's a little uh -huh. vodka, passion fruit, and a touch of cannabis, like two percent. That was it. But two percent is nothing. But it was totally delicious and this is dennis nice smiling yeah. halfway through this thing he's going i can't wait for the next time <laughs> oh well don't you need to be very careful about how this is all made and what is yes. infused with what's yes. like um what is a can of butter is an infusion yeah. uh i mean it's because it ain't just brownies obviously anymore. no no I no mean, this a is alice alice b toklas would be like out of business she have to branch no, out completely, into edibles. Completely, no, no, she, 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 different. she would have opened up her own restaurant by this time. You think this? Definitely. This is. Um, they should call it Alice's Restaurant. Ah. <laughs> ah, there's you a name. You can get anything so, you no, no, want. That, wait, that, that, that's a new pair. We should have Alice and Gertrude. Mm. Uh, <laughs> that's I, I, right. Alice and Gertrude. Yeah, okay. couple. Alice and Gertrude. Okay, anyway. that's it. So, but, so, so we what, we still what do you need to do. do? I sent him an email explaining who I was. I gave him my uh, information. He looked me up. In 10 minutes, I got an invite. And it was just so much fun. They explained everything, what they put in, how much of the dosage. Because he doesn't want people to go out of there being crazy and stoned. It's not like the episode when Cheech and Chung, they had these giant blunts during the show. Mm -hmm. They're smoking these giant blunts and they're real. Everyone is like going out there going, this is great. And they're just mm -hmm. totally stoned. 
This is not this. This is a five star dining. Mm -hmm. That's how good this food was. Maxine, you would not like anything on the menu because except the steak, maybe. There's I no chickens, a lot of fish. Although I don't eat it very often. It's Maybe only a once small a year if I do it. But is it is it worth it if I'm only eating one thing? That's my question. So well, he explains every bit of the food. And yeah, let me see if I get this. Well, I mean, what does he give you the Present? tips for the edibles? Sure. Like yes. No, no, no. <laughs> so he explains how it's made, how much is a dosage. And the way you cook with the marijuana, which I've been watching and learning, is you adheres to fats like butter, oils. You just can't throw marijuana in things and get stoned. You won't get stoned. You don't. And it doesn't work. But so the question is, do you want to get stoned or do you want to get high? I want to get high. I want to get relaxed and enjoy myself. I don't want to feel that I'm out of control. And none of us were out of control in that meal. And we all stood up and cheered at the end. But he said in the beginning, by the time you finish dinner, you all will not feel like hugging everyone. Oh God. Did you have and your he was right. It did was your, amazing. Did you still have your clothes on or were they off? No. Oh, and, and the food was so spectacular that um, like fluke, uh, we had scallops. With puff rice and then he made this one thing with the burrata the inside of the burrata which is a mozzarella and with the chili oil appeared to it it was five milligrams everything was basically five milligrams per serving per person how does that even work i mean how do you dose it i mean it's i went on line and it's looked, all mathematics you know, it's like tips for making edibles don't over chop your weed select your infused ingredients uh, mm -hmm. Can of butter, also coconut oil is something. Yes, um, I make all that. It says strain any plant matter, mix well, don't heat over 340 degrees Fahrenheit, and trust your taste buds. That's what yes. this article said. And it and it had how to calculate doses, lab tested flour. Um, yes. And how you do the math. You said it's math. It's uh, mathematics. And right. I'm not good at math, but Thank I have a, a gentleman, I'm not going to mention his name, who is one of my partners. He explained to me about the mathematics and dosing. So mm. I've learned from him and I keep a separate thing. And I every time I make something for myself, I can't sell it because it's not legal to sell yet. I don't have a license. So when I make it for my friends or myself, I send it out to a lab i have a lab i work with and they'll tell me if i'm overdosing or underdosing they'll tell me so i have it for the last year and a half exactly five milligrams it costs so, 79 dollars for what and they tell you it's exact you have to send like 10 pieces so they could see how equal they are hmm. i mean how do you know it's pure because right now i worry about being things being tainted and yes. especially, you know, drugs that someone would buy from somebody, um, you know, not well, that you street, don't do not, that. Right. But people do. And they've been putting mm -hmm. fentanyl in it. So and killing. They're people. cutting so, down on so that. Thank very, God. You know, yeah, it's well, tough. Well, about 20, 30 years ago, actually 30 years ago now, because I haven't really been doing anything since I've been married. Uh, the problem that I found, as you're talking about, it depends on. Or I used to do a uh, pot and uh, a little coke. Yeah, bad each, boy. <laughs> but, but but each time I had it, I got another I can effect. Pot, but not coke. Come on. Well, well right. coke. I. It, it's funny because coke. I, I had total oh, control boy. over it. I don't. I am of the two of you. I, I mean, the three of us. I am the one that's the outlier, mm -hmm. which is really kind of insane considering. My brother, <laughs> brother. Yeah, you know, well, we, well, we dedicate well, this show, by the way, to Mitch. I said to Mitch, Mitch the Mitch head of our company, the head of our company. He still remains the head, even though he's in. Well, because he was ahead. Yeah. He was ahead. He was. He was ahead of us all because he tried to work to get this. You should. People should be thanking our family because, because Mitch, he would go to all the meetings in California. He would push to get it get it uh, legalized. legalized and, and I, do that in thank goodness I do that in, in New Jersey life, mm. thank goodness in his lifetime it was legalized. but anyway getting back the, the, the way the way I did coke 
is when I wanted to stop drinking. I used to go to a restaurant to, to the bar and have one or two drinks mm-hmm. just to get a buzz. You know, and you, you know when you get a buzz and you sort of nurse mm-hmm. your drink. With the Coke, when I wanted to stop drinking, oh, what I did is I did a line or two of Coke and right. I got that buzz and I stopped. Oh my God. Is this is this really Malcolm Presents? What am I doing here? Yeah. No, Malcolm. this is years ago, Maxine, but it people hey, did that. Yeah, now yeah. I buy Studio my, 54, yada, yada, yada. Okay. But my goods, I get from a reputable person and it's pure. It's from a farm a pure farm and i know exactly where it's coming from right. it's never been touched and when i cook it you have to decarbonize it right that's what they so say so i have decarb- a decarbonizing machine and then i have an oil or butter machines yeah. you name it i got it well i have wow. a question how about if, th- if things become legal and the uh, the food becomes illegal and the restaurants become legal how do you know that the restaurant is doing is so meticulous that they're really doing everything that uh well you uh, have to know it's so you uh, have Miguel to Trinidad people that are legitimate well he's legitimate he's a legitimate well, right i know chef. but how do you know that all these pl- like as i said in california they might be doing uh uh cannabis well, you have cafes. to research there are a bunch of new women out there cooking and opening restaurants right all i was over just the country. looking at all these women who you sent to me um, yes, these women are are helping spark a revolutionary culinary weed industry yeah. with female entrepreneurs, um, inspiring weed food magazines. She yes. has supper clubs that you went to uh, a sleek oil infusion machine that can rival a kitchen aid in its utility, magical CBD golden milk elixirs and mm-hmm. luxurious recipes that would mm-hmm. make. Prosper Martinier, Martinier, proud, you know. Anyway, these women are uh, Megan DeCave, Sarah mm-hmm. Best, Jolene Rivera, Vera. Monica Lowe, Christina Lowe. Bellman, and they're at the forefront of the culinary, you know, ca- cannabis space. And and of course, the Miguel Trinidad and and, and he's uh, one of the first. And there's say, a few right. of them out there. Well, I, didn't, Miguel, I didn't hear your name. I didn't hear your name written. Rusty. W will be in the next forefront. Okay. You know what? It's not, you don't pay. When you go to these things, you're not allowed to charge for the, when you're eating the stuff, you can't charge for the marijuana that's in the food. They're charging you what they would put, um, like I go to Latour. It's $250 a person for Latour mm-hmm. by me. It's a five-star restaurant. And I get a wonderful meal with drinks, plus another $75 if I want wine t- tasting with it. This is two hundred and fifty dollars a person, and it's just they just charge you for the food. They don't charge you for the marijuana. They don't. And, it's all. Well, it's, it's a part food. of the it's charge, though. But it's they don't. It's charging you. If this was a regular restaurant, it would not be charged. There wouldn't be you would pay the same amount of price that I just paid for the food I got. And it was spectacular. It was like a going to a five star restaurant. That's sort of like gourmet. How about where if you opened up a coffee shop? <laughs> I, I I want bacon and eggs and some home fries. Uh, and, and 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 you get that cut with marijuana. I think this is the luxury market you're talking about. Um, that would be more the Alice B. Tokley. Uh... R- r- yeah, that would be Alice's restaurant. Right. Exactly. Yeah, I I, I like a, a tuna fifteen you know, a tuna and rye. Right. And, and, and that be, yeah, I, I don't know where, you know, where the cutoff line is. Neither do I. I think we have a frozen. Uh, we have here. a frozen Paula. Yeah, we have a frozen, frozen, frozen. I don't know. how. Can, can, can you hear us, Paula, or are you, uh, are you uh, out of it? Can you hear us? Uh, well, if you hear it, see if you can go on and off. Uh, oh, no, she's yeah. off now. Yeah. It's It's me and you, Max. Well, I think, I think she had too much of the night before. Too, too much of that stuff. I mean, I I don't know. Uh, I still don't know why this is blurry so much. Mm-hmm. This is weird. Mm-hmm. I I clean. I, I mean, I don't. Yeah. Know. Okay. Well. Oh well. Anyhow. I, I get. I, I I I like the concept of it, but I I think there's too much that can be taken advantage of. Yeah. You uh, know, it's it sort of. I I don't I don't want uh, teenagers going in or. Uh, you know, young couples going in 
and thinking they're going to get stoned for eating. Not, 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 off, not that they I don't, this. I don't think they have a... Hi, hello, you, here I am. You're back? My internet went out. Yeah, it's it's wonderful. Don't you just love uh, Opt Online? Oh, my God. Oh, only the best. I have the same problem all the time. Well, well you, you... Malcolm was you... concerned. Hold on. Malcolm was concerned about... Um, were there any young people there? Were, are, are, that young you have people to going be to events. You have to be twenty five or older to be invited. You have to be twenty five and old. Okay, we will so not let anyone at twenty five. Uh, and you, you have, have to be, be twenty five one to buy. Um, a, in yes, a, in a which I whatever. disagree. I disagree with that. I think twenty five. If I ever opened one up, it would be twenty five because I don't feel the brain for a young adult is formed till they're twenty five. So I don't believe <laughs> no brains are formed in anybody. <laughs> you can be 105 and still kooky. But but no, I agree. Well, I, with I you. like you're frozen again you, with your you... tongue sticking in. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Wait, let me get this. You can use it on. <laughs> no, hold on a second. I'm taking a picture of this because this is very funny. Uh <laughs> Paul is it. <laughs> Let's see if I can so, get it see if you can turn on and off again if you hear us. Uh she's I think I think her her service is as crappy as mine. Uh, I, I think if she wants to continue the show, she has to move. Oh uh, God. No, it, it's 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 the internet uh company. I have the same company and they are horrendous. Well, you know. can, can you change it? There's only one in your area. There's two, but they're both equally crappy. So it's, uh, you know, it just does. It, you you just either one. We've had both, and they they, no good. A A A T and T is not there. No, we only have Horizon and Optum Optum. Mm. And because I have AT and T, and it's pretty reliable. Yeah, I don't find the reliability. And, 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 and then they have a relay system. I don't know. My son put a. Uh... An adapter in one of the other rooms. So I plug that in, and it's, it's been pretty. Yeah. Watch, and then, and then uh, this week later, another show is gonna. Yeah, it's gonna uh, crap out on me. Yeah, her internet's kind of down. She just texted. Oh, she called. Okay, so well, she's, she's trying oh, to get maybe back. She's trying to get. She's back. Stoned. Oh God. Oh, maybe maybe God. maybe you're maybe you're stoned. Maybe it's not really. No, no. Oh, let me just tell you really quick. Okay, but do, do a wrap up just in case. Okay, the wrap up, the food was spectacular. We all had a wonderful time. Um, I didn't feel stoned when I left. I was a little happy. It was a little hot. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, well, you're, you're a little so happy when, when you don't do anything. That's true. I'm always happy. But the best part was we're in San Janeiro Festival. And of course, I Ooh. ate all but I had to get Zeppelis because I had the <laughs> they had the munchies, so they got bought a bag of Zeppelis. Zeppelis, and by the, the way, we, with extra sugar, please. Sugar. And we heart. didn't drive; we had right. a driver take us there and back. Because not we everyone being... has that. Well, or not everyone could, could could pay uh, two fifty for the dinner. A person. A person. Uh, two fifty a person. Yes. yes. Okay. Come on, Malcolm. You want to join? <laughs> yeah, I want to join. That's my yearly. Plus, it costs us to have the car. My housekeeper, her husband. Don't don't start. We, we 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 know what the if you if you went and added it up, it was a lot well, more. Well, here's most the best part. Are going to spend we, unless you have money. But here's the best part. Going home, we're going through the Holland Tunnel. It took us less than an hour, and I'm sitting in the car. I'm listening to music, and I turn around to Dennis. I go, uh. How did we get to Route 80? <laughs> <laughs> he had no idea where you were. Right. For, for all you know, it could have taken three yeah. <laughs> hours, but you wouldn't have known it. Well, we did the same thing with Dubonnet cocktails. The cocktails, the same Whoa. thing. Is it 10 o'clock? <laughs> what? <laughs> it was 11. It was 11 o'clock. Oh, my God. That and, I, and that and you giving me cookie a cookie. Yeah, when and, and you, when oh, you my did, God. No. That was funny. Because That's you did, before I knew no. how to dose. You're right. Because that's you before I knew how to dose. Right. Yeah. She yeah. used me as the guinea pig. Paul, <laughs> make sure you watch your show because you're freeze framed with your tongue sticking out. Do, 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 do you know? Do, really? Yeah. We, yeah. <laughs> you have to give me, and this is, by the way, just quickly, this is not CBD. This is THC, right? THC. Yes, it yeah. is. Okay. CBD okay. is different. To, to, okay. to tell the, tell the owner, uh, 
I'm knowledgeable of the difference. Quickly, go ahead. Well, TB THC is the marijuana flower, it's the flower, and CBD is hemp. You still could get, and now there's different ones, is Delta 8 hemp, is Delta 9, which is the same thing as THC, but it's hemp. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Uh, uh, this is the picture. So <laughs> this is the picture for 2023. I'm gonna get a calendar for next year without that picture. Uh, if anything came out of this, people will think we're stoned and we're not. Yeah, uh, and I'm not stoned. I'm I stoned on. I'm made... stoned on it not raining today. Or, you know, or they, they say high on life. This is my shirt today. Plant based diet. Oh, oh, good! Oh. I like that shirt. I want to get Fun one. Fun based on. I'll get you one. Okay, my shirt, like... my last shirt. Uh, I got uh, anyway, hey, guys. Hook forest. We're uh. we're almost finished. So you say, well, let's say our goodbyes. <laughs> All right. Well, shalom, uh, <laughs> shalom, uh, and uh, and shalom, everyone, uh, everybody, and everybody must... happy happy eighty seven fifty four. Right. No, yes. 57, 50, 84. 57, 84. Yeah. That's 57, 84. as in the Heinz ketchup. Heinz ketchup is your favorite number. Paul's favorite, favorite number is food. 57. Uh, yes, it it's a ketchup, 57 varieties. And guys, be, be, be safe. Drive be safely. Safe be safe, be well. May the force be with you. And see you next week. See you next week and, and we'll continue. <laughs> Enjoy. Malcolm. We'll have more fun conversations. You're listening about. to Tush Twins on malcolmpresents.com and if you like us mark like if you don't like us mark like anyway just mark like and send and, and the word follow. out to everybody else follow us and uh we're gonna have we're gonna try to find a website somebody to make us a website Bye. So there. all right ciao mean bye <laughs>